Well, you made it. This is your final workout with me in this three times challenge. You have been here consistently three times a week for four weeks and today we're gonna celebrate. We're gonna celebrate that by working on our power and strength. A great send off and sort of a victory lap for this awesome challenge that we've been on together. So if you're with me, all you need is a little space. So one last time, clear your area and let's do this together. So find your nice comfy squat position. We're gonna start with some squats right here. You know the drill, chest proud, hips pushed back. Good, keep it nice and tall. On your next one, sink down, tap those toes. Keeping that great posture throughout. Three, two, one, bring it up again. Get ready to sink it back down, tap out those toes. So today, our intervals are gonna flip back and forth between that power and that strength. Bring it up. Quick transitions. 30 seconds of one style, 30 seconds of the next quick transition in between. You're gonna notice a bit of a theme in today's. Get low one more time. Tap those toes. Bring that back up. Good, give that a little shake. This time, I want you to squat down, walk yourself out, so come on down. Walk out to that plank. Find that strong plank position. Pike the hips, bring it in. Stand it up, repeat, bring it down. Again, find that strong plank. Give me one more of these. And when you get down here, from your knees or your toes, give me a couple push-ups. Remember, it is just your warm-up, so make sure you do what's comfortable for you. Give me one more, and walk yourself back in. Good, bringing it back to those squats again. that chest proud. From here, I want you to transition into alternating lunges. Setting it up so that knee drives down towards the ground. And remember, you're not casting a shadow over that front leg. Your upper body is staying nice and tall. One more each side. And bring that to a boxer's shuffle, right here. Because it's go time. Okay, so look, we're gonna work on our jump squats and then we're gonna bring it back. We're gonna dial it back and we're gonna pulse in the middle of that squat. That's it, two exercises. Jump squat, squat pulse. Let's just go through that a couple times. Now, reminder of this jump squat, you need to sink before you drive. Get low and push, power through the feet, okay? Your squat pulse, you need to get low and stay. You are loading the legs the entire time, okay? We're gonna go through that twice, just like I said. So look, got about 15 seconds till go time. And then it's time to get to that ceiling. Jump squats. In five, four, three. Load those legs and drive. Go, go. Get as high as you can. Don't look at the ground. Drive up, push. Remember, this is about power. You need to get up there. 
If you're not jumping, that is okay. You know what to do. Get up to those toes. Get as high as you can in that range of motion. Let's go. Push, push. Get ready to transition. Bring it to that halfway point right here and start to pulse. Now look, as we pulse, we wanna let the back round. It's not happening. You're gonna fight against that. Keep it right here. Alternatively, don't let it come here. Come on. You are loading the legs. The glutes are working to pulse. Legs are loaded. Stay right here. Now, I don't know whether I mentioned it or not. We're gonna do this twice. So I need you to get ready to power up to that ceiling again. Get ready to transition. Three, two, one. Here we go, power it up. Come on, push. You are driving through your feet to try and touch the ceiling. Both feet driving through the ground. Come on, push, push. Don't stop, drive it up. Tighten the core, lift the chest. Don't look at the ground, come on. I know you can go higher. Get that arm up, reach for the ceiling, come on. Go for it, come on, push. Don't stop. Can you get a little higher? Come on, drive, drive, drive. Get ready to transition right here. Pulse it out. Stay loaded through those legs, hips push back. Look, your pelvis is gonna wanna tilt, your back's gonna wanna round. Fight through that, keep it strong. Come on, you get a break after this. Load the legs, push through the feet. Stay here. Come on, come on. It should burn. You're doing it right if it's burning. Come on, 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two. Shake that out. Nice work. Little active recovery right here. Wash it out. Let it go. Look up here. You get active recovery, I'm gonna show you what's next. Same concept applied to push-ups. So we're gonna do a nice full range of push-up from your knees or your toes until I tell you to transition to that pulse, which is gonna be right here. Knees or toes. Come on down here. Strong frame. Push into your hands to drive up. You've got under 10 seconds. Full range push-ups in five, four, three, two, one. Here we go, full range. Now, I know I've said this to you a lot, but do not lead with the nose. It rounds out the spine. We wanna lead with the chest. Bring the chest between the hands and work from right here. Right, don't let it get back here. Stay nice and strong. Knees or toes, guys. I want full range, keep going. Get ready to transition into those pulses right here. If you're on your knees, don't let your hips get back here. Okay, come on, stay forward. You're pulsing, knees or toes, chest proud, keep going. Don't let it become sort of this little chicken pecking, okay? Keep it low and strong, right here. Do what you can, take a break if you need. Got under 10 seconds. And then we go back to regular push-ups again. Knees or toes, get ready to transition in three, two, one, full range. Here we go. Now look. I want you to stay pressed into the palms. Again, knees or toes, it doesn't matter. You are driving through the palm of the hand. Don't let it become this. Keep that chest pulled forward, you've got this. Lift and lower, drive through the hands. Keep it strong. Tighten up the core a little bit. Help out those arms. We're gonna transition to that pulse again. In three, two, 
pulse it out. I know this feels tough. Don't let it round. Stay with me. If you need to take a rest, take a rest. Don't compromise that form just to power through. Reset. Find that form again and then go back to it. Drop the knees. Tighten up that core. Don't let the back bow. Don't let it pike. Come on, you've got five, four, three, two. Take a rest. Active recovery right here. That is two of our five exercises done. So next round, we're gonna be working on burpee and half burpee. Your burpee, I want you to focus on getting up from the ground and pushing to the ceiling. So the most important part of this burpee is there. Your half burpee, you're not coming up. You are staying low, okay? You ready? You got 10 seconds until go time. Full burpee, focus on that powerful push. Three, two, one, here we go. Come on, drive. Now look, if you want to go right to the ground, you can, but don't lose that power. Don't collapse at the bottom. Option of stepping that out also, you know what that modification looks like. Don't lose your strength, come on. Get ready to transition. Bottom half burpee. Three, two, one, here we go. Stay low. Now look, I'm not keeping my hips up here. You need to get low right here. Find the strength to keep the core engaged and flip it out and back. Come on, stay strong. Walk it out if you need. Stay with me. Come on, under 10 seconds here. Can you go a little quicker? Keep that strength, move it a little quicker. Get ready to transition in three, two, full burpee. Let's go, find that power. Come on, this is your last workout with me. Let's not disappoint, come on. Push, push. Look, you got this. Drive from here, drive from here, come on. Push. Hit the deck if you want, stay strong. Keep this going. Five, four, three. Transition to that bottom half, here we go. Stay low. I want you to take a little bit of focus on this one. Focus on keeping this engaged. Strong frame, right here. Plant those feet, tighten up the core, keep it strong. That's it, don't give up, keep them strong, come on. That's it, tighten up your glutes each time. Come on, come on, five, four, three, two, recovery. Take a little breath here. Next up, same concept, jump lunges. So look, you're going to plant one foot in the front, one foot in the back. It's not going to change. We are not alternating. Look, jump lunges right here. Low pulse after that transition. Yes? One side, and then we'll come back around and get the other. So, find that lunge position, remembering that back knee comes down to the ground. Under 10 seconds till go time, you ready? Power it up and drive in three, two, one. Here we go, push, push. Come on, I am pushing off both my feet. I'm driving up from here, push.
pushing through the feet. My whole body's working. But look, I am not collapsing. This is strong, come on, push. Get a little higher. Come on, drive. We're gonna transition to that pulse in three, two, one, sink it down. Now pulse right here. Again, back knee down to the ground. Don't let it be here. Look at the difference. Drop and stay here. Body nice and tall. None of this, no? Come on. Stay with me. Sometimes it helps to just come right here. Can you get a little lower? Nice job. Under 10 seconds. Transition to the other side. Three, two, switch up those feet. Plant the back one when you're ready. Back to that power. Push, remember, both feet are driving off the ground. I'm allowing my hips to lower so that I can power up to the ceiling. Yes? Come on, drive. Push. Now look, don't land rigid. Come on, absorb. Push, absorb. That's it. Chest up. Don't look at the ground. You don't want to go there. You want to go there. Come on. Get ready to transition. Bring it down and pulse right here. Back knee, the kneecap facing the ground. Again, none of this. Drop it. Body is strong. We're quiet from shoulders to hips. We're not letting it move like this. Here's the workload right here. Keep it going. Gather that breath. The good news is, we're moving on after this one. We don't double this one up. Three, two, shake that out, active recovery. Big deep breath. You've been keeping count? We have one more exercise in this style gonna be tricep push-ups. These are tough. I know it, you know it. Tricep push-ups are not easy, but you're gonna come down here. Knees or toes, as always, but a narrower handprint. Look, elbows are close to ribs, right like this. Yes, come on down here, full range, and then we will pulse. I need you to find your tricep push-up position. Push forward into the palms, drive forward. Three, two, full range, here we go. Now look, the elbows stay close to the body. Go to the knees so that you can work on that form. Don't let the elbows come here, okay? If you're making kind of a diamond shape with your elbows going out, I need you to pull in, keep going. Yes, close to the ribs. Now look, we're gonna transition. Bottom half pulse in three, two, one. Come with me. Now look, I'm on my knees, and you should be too, because these are difficult. If you're on your toes and you're hanging out up here, you're not getting the benefit. Drop it down. Get low, come on. Back side of the arm is our target. We are trying to work right here. So think about that. Connect to it and push. Keep it low. Come on. We're gonna transition to those full ones again. Three, two, one. Take a quick setback. Come on forward again. Full range. Here we go. Now look, as you get tired, you're gonna want this to come here. I don't want you to fight through. Bring your chest between your hands, drive up. Keep this going, chest proud. Don't let it round, pull forward, stay strong. Look, we got five seconds left before we transition to those pulses. One more time, you ready? Shake it out, 
Transition, bottom half. Here we go. Stay right here. Keep it going. I know, I'm telling you a lot of information, but it's because this form is so important. Don't let those elbows get away. Pull them in, pull them in. Lead with the chest. Try not to let it come here. You got this, guys. Stay open under 10 seconds in this pulse. Get low. Come on. Five, four, three, two, one. Push back. And when you're ready, come on up. Join me on your feet again. Give everything a shake. Now, good news. You already know what we're going to do. Even better news, we're only gonna go through each of those exercises one time through. So give everything a big shake. We're gonna start with those jump squats. We're gonna go down the line one more time. Think of this as your victory lap. Are you with me? I know you are. You're stuck with me this far. You're not leaving me now. So I need you to find your jump squat position. Get strong. 10 seconds, we're gonna power it up again. You ready? Five, four, three, two, jump squats. Come on, push. Higher than you have ever jumped before. Come on. This is your final round. Lead with the chest, power through the floor. Come on, come on. Keep it strong. Go to those toes, but do not give up this movement. Do not give up the intent. Keep that. Drive through the feet, come on. Come on, five, four, three, two. Transition to that squat pulse. Look, I know you wanna come here. Fight, keep that posture. Keep that intent for this victory lap, come on. Stay strong. If you feel your hips lifting and your pelvis tilting, I need you to elongate. Keep the load in the legs right here. You've got 10 seconds. And we're gonna transition to push-ups. Wide push-up, not narrow. Get ready. Transition in three, two. Come on down here. Wide push-up position. Full range, strong core. In three, two, one. Here we go. You know at this point, that I want you to push through your palms. I want you to keep that strength and drive through the hands each time. Drop to those knees. Get that range, guys. Come on. Keep going, you've got 10 seconds here. And remember, as you fatigue, it wants to come here. Keep it strong and get ready to transition in three, two, Pulse it down low, stay right here. Now I know it's your last time through, so your brain's saying, I'm gonna do this from my toes. That's amazing. If you wanna challenge yourself, but don't let it become top half, get low. Keep that strength. Lead with the chest. You've only got 12 seconds left. Wherever you're at, stay strong and get ready to transition, burpees are next. Three, two, one, come on up. Quick shake out, burpees, whenever you're ready. Let's go, power it up from the floor. Push through those feet, same as that jump squat, right? Power it up from the floor. If you're going to the ground, you need to power it right off the ground. Everything stays strong. Come on, push. You've got 10 seconds. Best burpees of your life, right here. Come on, five, four, three, two. Bottom half burpees. Keep it low and controlled. All of the strength is here, through the frame. Strong, reset, strong. Reset, don't let this round, you got this. Come on, keep it strong. 
Is this starting to go like this? Fix it. You've got the strength to do it. You've got the knowledge. Let's go. Keep it going. Stay low. You got under 10 seconds. Five, four, get ready to transition. Two, jump lunges, foot back, body tall. Whenever you're ready, get that power. Come on. Look, I know that you wanna do this. Do you know why I know that? I wanna do it too, but we're not going to. Come on, lift the chest, tighten the core. Drive through both feet, come on. 10 seconds here. Push through both feet, take out the impact, but not the intent. You want to drive, come on, push. Get ready to transition. Pulse it out. None of this. Come on, back knee to the ground. Strong body. Legs are working really hard. Come on. Bring it here if you need to. Focus on breath. But you've got 15 seconds. Can you get lower? Yes. Keep it going. Concentrate on your breath. 10 seconds. Change leg. Five, four, three, two. Other side. Find that power whenever you're ready. Let's do this. Final time through with these jump lunges. Look, I know, I know you wanna do this. We're not going to. Find that athleticism and that explosion of movement. Come on, push, push. Don't look at the ground. Come on, look up here, right here. Compress and explode. Keep going. Higher for three, two, one. Transition low, back knee down. At this point, there may be a bit of screaming going on here and here. Stay strong, drop those hips. No shadow over that front leg, right? Pick it up, stay here. You've got 15 seconds left. Triceps. After this, we transition to triceps. And then, that's it. Get ready to transition in three, two, one. Triceps down here. Again, knees or toes. Full range of motion in three, two, one. This is your last push. Stick with it right here. Full range of motion. Reset those elbows in. They are grazing your ribs each time you do your push-up. Keep it strong. You only have one task left. Come on, don't give up on me yet. Here we go. Transition, get low, pulse. Squeeze that back side of the arm. Mind over matter here, guys. Get that back side of the arm. Squeeze it and stay low. Push through those palms. Don't give this up. Stay with it. Because you've got 15 seconds left. Come on. Come on. Here's your 10 seconds. Come on. Six, five, four, three, two, one, oh my goodness, push all the way back into that child's pose. Take a second right here. Release that and sit up nice and tall. Guys, you made it. Join me one more time on your feet. Keep those feet moving for just a second. Bring that heart rate down a little. Roll the shoulders. Four weeks. Three workouts every week, and you did it. Thank you so much for trusting me with your workouts for the last month. That is a huge honor, and I 
thank you. Roll your arms forward. I hope, I truly hope, you realized that you can do a lot more than you thought you could when you started this journey. Take your hands, clasp them behind, pull to one side, drop your ear down. Go to that other side. Release that, stand nice and tall. Good, find your balance, quad stretch. Get that strong balance in there, knees close together, hips push forward. Switch to that other side. Set that down, shake everything out. Thank you for sticking it with me this long. And I hope to see you again on another adventure. Thanks everybody.